Uh, let's... Oh, boy. Oh, we're in a fight. We're in a fight. We're in a fight. Hi, friends. How are you? This is the Call Donut speaking, and welcome back to some Ark Survival Evolved. I've been scouting around for a little while looking for something to tame, and I found a level 4 female Giga. You can see level 4 female right there. Uh, with a nice light green color. I saw that level 120, obviously, in a previous episode, and I really wanted to go after it, um, but we didn't have the resources. And we won't for a long time, because a, a perfect giga would take something on the order of, like, 5,000 narcotics, and uh, you basically need a platform saddle to have enough trank arrows and crossbows to take it down. However, a level 4 giga... Actually, hang on, we need a little more brightness. Sorry about that, guys. A level 4 giga like this one is still powerful, but gives us a chance to actually take it down. So that's what we're going to be going for today. With the same strategy that you saw from me in that previous episode, though, where we are going to be just trying to um, shoot it from our Quetzal and deal some damage that way. So this, this is going to be our strategy. We're going to see how this goes. Um, looks like it has an aggroed on us, which is a bit of a problem. Is it stuck? Please tell me it's stuck. It's stuck! Guys, for however long I can milk this, we have a Giga stuck on a tree. And it's not up the mountain where it's gonna get hit by predators or anything like that. It's like by the beach. This is pretty much as ideal conditions as you could hope for here. So if this works out, we could get some pretty great stuff. Looks like it's gonna come unstuck right here. Um, okay, it's coming towards the ocean? It's coming towards me still, but I don't think it can hit me. No, it can't. Uh, tough thing is, though, it's right under me, so I can't shoot it. Well, there we go. It's changing positions. Yeah, I can't hit it from here. Okay, so we're going to have to move. Uh, let's try getting it stuck on another tree. Let's see if we can do that. Um, I mean, this might be our best bet. It's just to move around a lot. And then, see if we can get it stuck, and even if we can't, we can still do something like this, and get shots off, like that, exactly. This is, this is gonna be kind of my concept here. That is ideal, yes, okay. So it's stuck with its head pointed right at us. This could be really good. Uh, oh shoot. Let me make sure it can't kill me, real quick, cause it just got pretty high up right there. That could have been real bad. Fortunately, it's removing a lot of its own cover. Uh, I can't really hide behind the trees anymore, which helps. Uh, we do have a magroad, or her aggroed. But she's kind of stuck on some rocks, which helps. Uh, okay. She's turning around. Coming this way. Get another shot off. This is going to be a little bit of a challenge. Even though it's low level, it's still tough because... Um, why, why can't I... Oh, there we go. It's loading up. Yeah, it's still challenging. Uh, it's running into the water. That's not good. Um, not really excited about that. Looks like it's eating something, possibly. Okay. Maybe it ate a trial bite. I don't know. Uh, let's see if we can get aggro back. Okay, it's, it's distracted, which could be a good thing. Um, could be a blessing, could be a curse. I don't know yet. Uh, we're going to try to draw it back over here. If we can draw its aggro, that's going to help big time. It looks like... I think we aren't hitting it. But we're just not making a lot of progress so far. So this is going to be a bit of a challenge. Uh, that should have been a hit. Yeah, that was a hit. Okay. I can see blood splatter from this distance, apparently, which is helpful. It's good to know when we're actually making progress. Okay, we got a hit off that time. I don't know if that one was. I can move a little closer, though. It looks like it might be going after a Gallimimus or something. I can't tell. It was probably going after something that was running away, and that's why it was circling. Uh, we have the ability to shoot at its tail, which is kind of nice. Okay. Uh, it's, it's, it's very stuck. Oh, my gosh. Quetzal, why, why are you putting your head in the way, B-17? Please no. Okay, we got a hit off. Please. 
thing is, with these Gigas, their Torpor drops so fast, we basically have to be shooting at it full time to make progress here. Uh, so this is going to be a little bit challenging since we don't have a platform. But I figure with a level 4, it's worth giving it a shot. So we're going to do what we can here. Um, come on. Oh, Quetzal, why? Why B-17? Why do you have to do that? Uh, let's move up a little bit. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous at that height. Just because we don't have a super high level Quetzal. Okay, we're definitely safe right there. Looks like she's still locked on us, though. Not stuck on anything, just trying to attack us. So this is exactly what we want. We're able to get a lot of great shots off here and keep her aggro. We're going to keep doing this. And I'm not even going to pause to shoot. Pause between shots. I'm just going to keep going. That torpor buildup will accumulate. And then when she does run away for a little bit... Um, that buildup will keep the Torpor drop from being too severe. So that's that's the idea here, guys. Um, she's back. Oh, that's really scary. Oh, boy. If we shoot our Quetzal, we might fall off and die. That's kind of cool, though. Oh. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man, that's terrifying. That is terrifying. Okay, all right, we're doing fine. We're doing real fine, guys. Doing just fine. That's exactly what we need. Okay, here we go. Let's keep shooting. We're getting a lot of great shots off right now. Um, got 100 arrows left. We're about halfway through our first crossbow, but I do have a second with me, so we should be good to go. We put a, pu a couple of trank darts in her at the start, too, which should be pretty helpful. Um... And I did put a couple more in her before we started the video where I was trying to start the tame on the mountain, but uh, I got into some trouble with the cold, so I decided to just wait it out and start the video here where we could really get into it. Anyway, um, let's take a look at where she is. Looks like we're okay. Um, she's still on us, and she's pretty much killed everything else in the uh, nearby area, so we can pretty much just keep shooting. This is a great opportunity, guys. Uh, for reference, I don't think I told you exactly where we were. We're up on, uh, Fars Peak, I think it's called. It's in the very northeast of the island, right by, uh, that north island with all of the carnivores on it. Pretty darn close to there. So that's where we're hanging out right now, doing this tame. Uh, she's, like, kind of in the shallow water, which bothers me. Uh, I don't think she would drown, but it'd be such a shame if she did, so I'm a little worried about it. Um... Here, I think what we should do is maybe just bring her over a little bit, just to be safe. We'll bring her over just a little, so that she doesn't risk dying. Hopefully not close enough to target anything else, though, still, so we should be okay. Let's check where she's at. Okay, she's coming right back over. Still right where we need her, right below us. And now she won't drown. So this is great positioning right here. We've got her right where we want her. Uh, this should be really good. Oh, boy. Okay, our Torpor is fine. It's the great thing about a Quetzal is it has a huge amount of Torpor. We do have to be a little bit careful, though, because uh, our position right now is a little bit iffy. Uh, the wing is a little bit close to where we need to be shooting to hit the Giga's head, so it's a little bit scary, but that's okay. We're doing all right. Okay, so far so good. Down to 80 arrows, but we're making good progress. Uh, we're about to run out of the durability on our first crossbow. But man, I'm really seeing, we, we didn't even make a dent in that level 120 giga, by the way, guys. Uh, when we tried that a couple episodes ago, no. We did not get close. Uh, let's see, what's, what's happening? The giga's making a loop, but it looks like no big deal. Should be no big deal. Yeah. She just stopped again. Okay, so this is okay. This is fine. And we can still get hits in. Okay, this is excellent. This is no big deal at all, really. We're still in great shape. Uh, I'm a little nervous about the positioning, because to actually get a shot off, we do have to be very close to the edge of the saddle. Uh, it's, it's a little scary, but I think we'll be all right. Okay, nine minutes in, and we're still doing great. Still doing just fine. 
Uh, I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna use the Giga for yet. Probably if we do fight the Broodmother or any other bosses, uh, that would be really helpful to have a Giga in our arsenal. Uh, because these things, even at like low levels, come in with over like 20,000 health, 30,000 health easy, and do several thousand damage. And oh! <laughs> Did you guys see that? Did you see that? Oh, that is nuts. That is nuts. That is nuts. Oh my gosh. You have got to be kidding me. I almost just fell off. Oh, that's terrifying. That is truly terrifying, honestly. Um, that That is crazy. That is crazy. I'm about to break our, uh, our crossbow right here. I'd like to get shots on the head, but I don't think I can get them without hitting the Quetzal, and we just almost fell off. Ooh, I can hit the corner of the eye, though. Okay, that works, and that gets a headshot for us, so that's pretty good. All right, we're down to, like, 55 arrows. I don't know if this is going to be enough. We might have to, like, fly down and craft more. All right, let's get this on the bar and equip Trank arrows. Okay. Still doing pretty good, but I'm a little bit worried. This is not going quite as well as I was hoping. I was hoping we'd have it down by now. Um, although we're still making pretty good progress. Getting some shots off. The Gigas are actually quite fast, it looks like. Uh, I know they don't have much stamina, but she is pretty fast. Uh, let's see. Can I get a shot off? No, I really can't get a shot from this position. She's changing positions. Is she going to fight that RG? That's bad. That's really bad. Wait, did she pass out? Nope. Still at large. Okay. Uh, let's... Oh, boy. Oh, we're in a fight. We're in a fight. We're in a fight. This is really bad. I was hoping this would not happen. Um, this is exactly what we did not need right here. Shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. This is not what we needed. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Why is it not attacking? I am pressing left click on my mouse, and it was not attacking. Uh, we probably just lost the Giga. Easily, right there. Why am I not getting hits off? Okay, she's dying, she's dying, but we have to pull up. We have to pull up, or we're going to get killed by the Giga. Okay. Yes, okay, we're killing the RG, we're killing the RG, we're killing the RG, we're killing the RG. Oh my gosh, okay. It was level 11, so it's alright. Uh, we got a couple Trank arrows out of that, I suppose. And it's distracted. Okay. The Giga was distracted for a minute, too, so that helps. Uh, she's on the run. Why? Why is that happening? Uh, let's try to fly away from the RGs a little bit. Is she stuck? If the Giga is stuck, this is great news. Um, why can I not right-click? If she's stuck, I'll take it. But otherwise, this is really bad. What's happening to us right now? Uh, yeah, this is not how I wanted. To oh, pull up. This is not how I wanted this to go, guys. Uh, I thought we would have her down by now. I under I underestimated the Giga, I suppose. Uh, let's see if we can get her in a position where we can shoot. Okay, looks like this is a good spot. Yeah, we're getting shots off again. Oh, she's stuck? No, she's not stuck. Darn it. And I can't see the head. This is bad. This might not work out. Um, 15 minutes. I thought 150 tranks would do it on a level 4. Clearly I was wrong. I'm going to keep shooting, but we'll see. Uh, this has been a pretty rough go, though. We almost got killed by an RG, which meant that the Giga went free for some uh, Torporn loss. It's, it's been a little bit rough. We still have 30 arrows and the potential to maybe land and make more. But that's going to be really rough. Like, the Giga will probably lose a ton of its, uh, its Torpor in that time period. So really not ideal um, if that's what happens. I can't see the head. I can't see the head, which is a problem. Uh, I can if I do this. Wait, where, where, where is she? What, what is she doing? Okay, she's coming back. She's coming back. Okay, we can we can see her. I don't think the RG is coming for us. So we should be able to just shoot. 
Oh, crap. Oh, we gotta deal with this now. Okay, that's great. Alright, GG, we lose. Okay. Fine, cruel world. I give up. What level's the RG? It's level 36. Okay, we can take it down, probably. Uh, but this is gonna be a huge setback, honestly. It's on top of us. That's really bad. Fortunately, we're faster than it, which gives us a shot. Is it even taking damage? Okay, it's bleeding. It's bleeding. It's bleeding. Uh, the Giga is doing who knows what right now. Uh, losing Torpor, actually. That's what. That's a pretty darn good guess. Okay, we are killing the RG for some XP, so that helps. That's not bad. I'll take it, I guess, as a consolation prize. It's kind of crappy, though. Okay, let's go. This is our only shot. Only chance. One more go. One more go. It's the only chance we're going to have to do this. The only way this happens is right here with these last 20 arrows. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. It is literally level four. And we can't kill it. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Can I get some headshots? I can't even get the angle right to do a headshot. I can't even get low enough. That's how bad this is. All right. Well, we're hitting in the neck. Uh, we're almost down to half of our last crossbow. So we may not even have a chance to make more arrows and tame it. This, this might just totally crash and... This might just totally crash and burn. Just might. Just might. We may just totally crash and burn. Uh, get on the Quetzal, see what she's doing. She's looping around, okay. Uh, and looping around more because reasons. Did she de aggro? What's going on? She's eating other stuff. Alright, we're, we're in hot pursuit here. Uh, this is kind of good. Oh my gosh, Quetzal. B-17, why do you do this to me? Okay, we need... We need shots. And our Quetzal is not cooperative. Alright, I think we aggroed her again. Maybe? Yeah, I think we got her. No, we didn't. Come on. Come on, B-17. What are you doing to me? Why? Why, cruel world? Oh, man. This is really bad. This is really bad. We're about to run out of arrows. This is pretty much GG, guys. Uh, yeah, I think we've lost the battle with the Giga. We will not be taming one this episode, apparently, because it's too strong. It's just too much. We've met our match, guys. We gave it a good go, but with eight arrows left, I don't think this is going to work out, and even if it does, she might drown, so this may not go so well. Um, okay, four, three, two, one. Oh. All right, I'll try to make some more arrows, guys. But I think it might be time to face the inevitable. Uh, I think she can't get to us. Get some thatch. Okay, quickly get some flint. Get a lot of flint, okay. More thatch. More flint. Okay, put that away, get some fiber. And we can make more arrows! We can keep going, guys. The fight isn't over yet. We still have a shot. Okay, we're going to get on. We're going to get on and get up so we don't die. Uh, let's keep an eye on her. Let's go ahead and let's transfer 100 narcotics over, and let's go ahead and make some arrows. Let's make 30 more of these, and then we'll make some more tranks. Here we go. There's still hope, guys. We can still do it. I should really have done these in the opposite order, but that's okay. Um... Okay, there we go. There's still hope. We could still do it. 
We could still take down the Giga. Now we might run out of crossbow durability and have to make an actual bow. Wouldn't that be something? If we tamed it after going to a bow. But I haven't given up yet, guys. We still have a lot of resources. There's still a chance for us to take this thing down. Okay, we have 20 more arrows. And then we're going to have to go and make an actual bow to pull this thing off. If this doesn't work. I don't know. I mean... Am I even doing anything to this thing? I'd love to be able to see how much torpor it's at right now. That would be really nice. Um, we're giving it a run for its money, I guess. Having put almost 180 tranks into it at this point. Uh, it's still coming for us, right? Yeah. We're still giving it a run for its money. Alright. We just aggroed it again. Let's see. Where, where is she? She's right there. Okay. Oh, she moved. She moved to the other side. We're going to fire off a shot. Come on. Just stay in one place. Stay in one place where I can shoot at you. Please, 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 please. Please don't do anything. Please stay right there. Alright. We can get a few more shots off. Okay. This is good, but not good enough. Oh shoot. We need more. Trank. I can make 28 more. Yes, we can do it. <laughs> Come on, guys. We can do this. Come on. 200 Trank arrows. It's got to be enough. Come on. If it isn't, I don't know what to do. We've tried everything, quite literally. Uh, we've used a long neck rifle, a crossbow, farming trank arrows on the fly, potentially switching to a bow when this thing breaks. I don't know what else to do. And now we're cold. Fantastic. Uh, so we're going to need food soon. That's excellent. Okay. Great. Great news. Alright, 19 more tranks. We're probably going to have to fly up and make an actual bow. Oh my gosh. You've got to be kidding me, right? Uh, but I'm willing to do it. We're going to try to see if that's even possible to take this thing down. I think we found where we should have been moving this thing to the whole time, though. It was just right up by this cliff. Um, this is ideal, honestly. But wow, okay. Uh, we've put in over 200 tranks, I think, at this point. And still no sign of falling down. Okay. Come on. Please, 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 please. Okay, so we're going to run out of the crossbow bolts and the arrows at the same time. So we'll have to go back and mate both, probably. Assuming it doesn't miraculously fall unconscious on our last arrow here. Uh, but no. Okay, so we're going to have to go make even more. You've got to be kidding me, right? We're going to try. I'm going to keep doing this until we knock it out. It's futile, I think, in the end. But we're going to give it our best shot, no matter what. We're going to do whatever it takes to possibly knock it out. Okay, so we're going to get a whole bunch of thatch. We're going to get a whole bunch of fiber. We're going to make some regular bows. And we're going to do this, guys. Here we go. This is it. Oh, yeah. We got this. We got this. We got this. Okay. Let's get back on. We're doing it again. All right. Craftables arrows. We're making 32 of you. We're making more trank arrows as we go. There we go. This is it. Okay. The fight's not over. We could still win. We could still beat this thing. We could still kill it. We could still kill it. I mean, uh, knock it out, not kill it. Come on. All right, this is going to break in a second, but uh, still not bleeding, still not showing any signs of slowing down, and still awake. Oh, boy. Well, I think that might be it, guys. 
I think perhaps it's time to concede defeat in the face of overwhelming odds. It may be time to give up and go home. We'll shoot it five more times. We'll shoot it with these last few arrows. And I think we've lost. <laughs> I just looked it up, guys. You want to know how many Trank Arrows, on average, it takes to tame a level 1 Giga? Which is basically what we're trying to do. 64 from a crossbow. 64! But you know why we didn't tame one? Because I looked it up in the time until all Torpor depleted is a single minute. A single minute. So, now I know why we lost. Because... We couldn't keep it continuously down. We couldn't continuously shoot it with drank arrows, and unfortunately, that screwed us over. Uh, it was not a great, not a great run there. I would really have loved to get a Giga. I thought this was the best opportunity we were ever going to have. And had I started with this tactic of being on the cliff, which I didn't realize would work as well as it did, I, I thought that he would be able to climb the cliff a little more than he was. Uh, so I was relying on my Quetzal, like especially over here, where the cliff is a bit shorter, it wouldn't have worked. But long term, probably would have been better to just pull him over to those high cliffs and shoot him the way we were at the end. And then I think we could have done it, maybe. Uh, but... We still don't have a Giga. It was a bust. Um, <laughs> definitely not ideal. Uh, so we'll get him next time, I guess, or the third time, or the fourth time, or the fifth time, or the sixth time, or whatever it might be. Uh, let me turn up the gamma a little bit for you guys. Hey, but we do have a level. We do have a level. We might as well apply that. We'll go over 2,000 health officially on B17, and uh, let's take down this RG. Why not? Let's do it. Okay. Yeah, you. Come on. Let's do this. Alright, guys. Well, I think it was a pretty fun day. I'm kind of tired, though. It, it was a long process there. Um, it, it was pretty rough. I was hoping we could tame the thing, take it over to the North Island up there and uh, do some training. I thought that would have been a for a really cool montage, but it wasn't meant to be, I guess. Uh, it just didn't work out. Not for a lack of effort, though. Uh, so I hope you have enjoyed, guys. Please remember to like and subscribe if you did. This has me, Call Donuts, speaking goodbye, friends. <sighs> and I will see you all next time with some more ARK Survival Evolved.